Hey everybody, this is Brett with Summit Auto in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, and today we are checking out this really good looking 2021 brand new Jeep Grand Cherokee L edition. So obviously the brand new body style for 2021 from the Jeep lineup here. This is an Overland package. It has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine, 290 horsepower. It's gonna get you 25 miles per gallon on the highway, 18 city and an average of 21 miles per gallon. Bright white is the color. We shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second. So if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, smartphone, or television, I highly recommend turning them all on right now because it is your best way to check out the looks, styling, and options of the vehicle before seeing them in person, before seeing it in person. And if you like the video and want to subscribe to our YouTube channel where we do videos of our new and used inventory each and every day in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos we do each and every day. Speaking of those videos, on this video we're going to do uh, the walk around that we just did and we're going to check out the original window sticker and then we're going to check out everything that this vehicle has to offer on the interior from the radio to the seats to the uh, options that it has on the inside. I do like the uh, new lettering for the Grand Cherokee on the sides here. We'll take a look at the original window sticker. Feel free to pause this. I'm not going to go through everything, but most of it. But feel free to pause this to check out to make sure it has all the options you're looking for. Grand Cherokee L Overland. Uh, you get the Napa leather seats, global black interior. 3.6 liter Pentastar and eight speed automatic transmission comes with the Jeep Wave membership, the Quadratrack 2 four wheel drive system and select terrain. Everything on your left is standard equipment. And then this one has the customer preferred package, which gives you the luxury tech group or which comes with the luxury tech group, which is 1995, which gives you those Napa leather seats, the rear view auto dimming digital display mirror, which we'll check out. That's a pretty cool system. Has a wireless charging pad, the power driver seat with back massage. My new favorite option on the Grand Cherokees. A 12 way power adjustable driver seat, front passenger power seat with back massager, 12 way power adjustable front passenger seat as well passenger memory seat and uh, manual second row window shades as well as four zone automatic temperature control so pretty cool uh, stuff that they uh, that comes with that luxury tech group advanced pro tech group 3 which is 1995 gives you active driving assist system heads up display intersection collision assist system night vision with pedestrian and animal detection surround view camera system interior rear facing camera Rear backup camera washer, integrated off-road camera, and map in cluster display. Trailer tow group is a uh, tow prep group, I should say, is 695, which gives you the trailer hitch zoom. It also gives you the cover in the back, so if you wanted to put a hitch on this, it'd be easy to do without cutting into the plastic or anything. And then you get the Uconnect 5 navigation with 10.1 inch display which is $17.95 option. It gives you the Macintosh 19 speaker, high performance audio, and the 950 watt amplifier. Uh, this one has the air suspension and active dampening delete credit, which is $750 off the price. Total MSRP is $62,920. And if you wanna get your summit price in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to our website to get all the rebates and incentives on this particular Jeep uh, going on right now. Three year 36 bumper to bumper, five year 60 powertrain, 21 miles per gallon average, 18 city, 25 highway. It has not been rated yet for government uh, crash test ratings. Um, we'll go around the rest of the outside of the vehicle here. Uh, take a look at the Overland rims. These are 20 inch rims, and this one comes with Bridgestone Acopia tires. And these tires are 265 50R20s, kind of a highway um, all-terrain tread pattern on them, more of like a highway though. Um, 
Obviously brand new four wheel disc brakes has the backup parking sensors right there. The dual rear exhaust that's integrated right into the bumper. And you can see that cover right there. So if you were to put a receiver hitch on there, that cover comes off and you can uh, get it installed right there. The uh, back gate here is a power gate. So you have the third row seats here. Now these are power full down. So you just have to press those buttons that are right there. You can see that the headrests automatically go down and that these seats go down pretty nice and flat. So now the uh, second row seats go down as well and you can put those down with those buttons right there. Now you can't make them go up, uh, but you can make the third row seats go up by pressing those buttons again and holding them. You do get a nice storage area back here. And this is where you'd put the bar in and turn your spare tire down. And to get this gate down, you press that button. And just like all the Jeep products, it'll beep at you three times before coming on down. You get the LED tail lamps back here. You get the L logo, indicating that you have the third row seats. Chrome Jeep logo, Chrome 4x4, and the Overland logo right there. It's actually got a world in the design there. Really a good looking design. Notice the uh, chrome on top of the painted has the enter and go system. So you saw that everything lit up when I put my hand in there. That's because I have the key in my pocket and it'll automatically unlock the doors. Um, if you have the key in your pocket, it has the blind spot monitoring, heated mirrors, directional signals. Inside you get that black Napa leather interior. And remember it's got the massaging seats on this one. Get the Overland embossed into the backrest. Really nice bolsters on there. And the 12 way power driver and passenger seat in the front. Factory floor mats, auto headlamps. You get the power tilt, telescopic steering wheel. Nice real wood grain trim. Uh, looks really good. Here's your memory driver seat button. That's for your massaging seat. Power windows, power locks, power mirrors, get the gloss black inserts and the uh, Macintosh sound system here. <clears throat> Once I turn that ignition on it, it lights up Macintosh there. And these mirrors do power fold in. I think I gotta have the vehicle on once again for those to work. So let's hop inside, take a look at everything that the interior has to offer. You get the big, I think it's a 12 inch display up front here. Um, really good looking. And of course the oil pressure is low because the vehicle is not on. Um, <clears throat> anyways, you have your digital speedometer there. You can change your different views. You can put up all these like apps on there, including your miles per gallon. Um, navigation system you can have in there as well. Uh, night vision. I mean, like just the craziest stuff out there. So you can do a lot with that instrument cluster. The heated leather wrap steering wheel. You have your cruise controls here, adaptive cruise controls. And then this is your active driving assist, uh, lane detection on there as well information center controls that's how you get those different screens up right there by that button it has the paddle shifters on it and uh, you get the wood grain trim on the steering wheel the gloss black on there as well and uh, just a really nicely laid out interior you get the macintosh tweeters up there this is the uh, 10 inch 10.1 inch 5c uconnect radio 
it has the factory navigation system on it as you can see and uh, really a cool system go to your home screen here gives you the radio AM FM and Sirius of course you can do Bluetooth um, and then you have all your different uh, settings you can hear do here Sirius you can connect a USB AM FM um, and just everything that you want to do on this radio you can do your climate controls here as well including your dual climate controls um, <clears throat> you can check out your uh, vehicle information center here so I'm not sure if we can do this yeah so there's your fam cam which is pretty cool so you can see what's going on in the third row seats the second row seats um, and you can zoom in on like say that that kid is the one that's not being heavy and you can zoom in on that person or the person in back It'll make sure everybody's comfortable and um, zoom in where you need to, which is really cool. Really a cool system. You can check out your surround view camera, and you can see just how nice and clear everything is on there, including your backup camera there, which is super clear. You can do a wide view, wide view of the front, narrow view of the front. Uh, that's for if you put a hitch on here to hook up to your boat camper or trailer, and you can zoom in. Over your hitch, and then they have the trail cam, which is uh, this is, system is out of the Wranglers where they first had it, where it kind of gives you an idea of where your tires are going to be heading in the future. And you can actually clean that camera too. It's got uh, windshield washer fluid on. We must be low, um, but really a cool system on there. Uh, up here, you get your start stop, lane departure, stability control, parking sensors. You can turn those off and on. We can get out of the cameras there. Um, you can put those third row seat headrests down whenever you want. And then you have your different apps here. Now you can um, do a device manager. So you can actually do Android Auto or Apple CarPlay uh, Wi-Fi through the radio here or Bluetooth. It's either Bluetooth or Wi-Fi, but you can do uh, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay without actually having to plug it in. And then that you can project your screen to that screen from your phone and then use whatever you want on the screen. It's really a cool system. We're going to do a demo on that one of these days. Uh, down here, your heated and cooled seat buttons, your heated steering wheel buttons, all your other climate controls. These, uh, this opens up like so. There's your wireless cell phone charge pad, two USBs, two USB-Cs, and AUX jack. Here's your QuadraTrack 2 system, auto snow sand mud rock and sport your eight speed automatic transmission four wheel drive low it has a neutral setting for flat towing and downhill assist control you do get two cup holders there and uh let's see if we can go to all you can do your different ambient color change uh, so right now we're we're blue you could go to the green the white um yellow and that you can see where it changes all those colors and it kind of changes if you look right under the wood grain trim there watch as i change colors here we'll go to red green or aqua and then blue really a cool system uh so much stuff that we could go through on this radio but we got to finish the video here uh, you get that wood grain trim that wraps around to the passenger side as well you get the Panoramic Vista roof, second row fixed glass, front power sunroof, SOS and assist. It does have the sunshade. There's your sunshade controls, sunroof controls. You can vent it, home link controls. Um, and then there's your rear view camera. So this is actually a video of what's going on behind you. Um, you can turn that on and it, it takes a little bit to get used to, but you can dim it. And then you can also adjust the height of it. Zoom it up, zoom it down, or you can just turn it off and it turns into a normal rear view mirror. A pretty cool system there as well. We'll take a quick look at the back seats and then I will start it up and we will, uh, we'll start it up and then we'll check out all the lights on and do a final walk around here. 
but you get the second row quad seating. These back seats are heated. You get rear air controls, heated seat controls, two more USBs, two more USB-Cs, and then a 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in. So you can get to the third row, and they kind of stole this out of the Pacifica. Uh, they have it on a slider right there, and that kind of shifts up and then slides forward to, for easy access into that third row. And uh, I'm actually gonna go and sit back there so you can see how much leg room I have. And uh, just give me one second, I'm gonna pause it while I get up there. All right, I'm in the back of the Grand Cherokee L now. And you can see I've got enough room for my knees. I'm not up against the seat. I'm six foot. Um, and this seat's back, I think, pretty much as far as it can go. Now you can adjust that to go forward if, it, if the person back here needs a little bit more leg room. Um, and then, of course, when you're sitting back here, uh, to get out, you can just pull that button or pull that latch. And you can slide the seat up yourself. So it's, it's really convenient to get in and out of the vehicle. And uh, you can see now that that seat's up, just how much leg room I have so really pretty spacious back here the other cool thing is you get two you or you get a USB and a USB-C plug-in if you got your cell phone back here you get the Grand Cherokee and the Grand Cherokee L uh, icons on the windows as well that's where the fam cam looks down on you and uh, yeah it's uh, pretty nice back here seats are comfortable and I'm going to hop out here real quick, and we'll finish the video. All right, now that I'm out of the vehicle, I just wanted to show you it does have these second row sun shades on there, which, you know, go down and they hide away when you don't need them. But it's really nice if you got, you know, kids sitting in the back, you want to protect them from the sun. And you get child safety locks on the back doors. Get the same trim on the back doors. You get the ambient lighting back here as well. There's that Macintosh I was talking about that's lit up in the speaker there. And uh, you do you do get the capless fuel fill. The other thing I like is there's no more, you know, inside release. You can just press the button and get to your fuel that way. Let's start it up, and then we'll do one more final walk around with all the lights on and everything. There are those LED tail lamps. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you've gotten a really good idea of the overall looks and styling of the vehicle inside and out. There are those LED running lights and headlights. I must have the brights on and that's why the uh, fog lights aren't going on. But notice you do get the chrome tow hooks on there seven slotted grill that's all chromed out and the chrome jeep logo on the front like i said hopefully you enjoy the video and learned a little bit about the jeep grand cherokee l especially the overland edition and the 10.1 inch radio with the macintosh sound system and to see more pictures of this jeep or one of our other 450 new and used cars trucks scvs minivans wranglers you name it we got it go to that website right there www.summitauto.com Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications. You'll get updates on the videos we do each and every day here at Summit Auto. In fact, any second, you'll see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel. In the upper left, a link to more Grand Cherokee L videos like this one in the upper right. A link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those. Check us out. And we're super excited to help you with this brand new 2021 Jeep Grand Cherokee L Overland in bright white clear coat. Thanks again for checking out the video and remember to like, like subscribe and share.